Majesty, the prophecy has come true. Finally, the day has arrived. Who dares to disturb me when I'm with my lovely concubine? The queen has given birth to a little princess right when the sky was on fire. So I fetched the sky watcher to explain this phenomenon. Sky on fire? Oh. What is this strange thing happening in the sky, sky watcher? Your majesty, there are three categories of auspicious omens and what we've just witnessed belongs to the first category. The Red Phoenix is a goddess from the heaven. When the queen gave birth to the little princess, the Red Phoenix was flying on top of the palace. The little princess is a reincarnation of the goddess. She will help prosper our kingdom. I want nothing to do with this reincarnated goddess and her mother. She robbed my happiness ever since she became my queen. Now it's my turn to make her miserable. <gasps> But, my lord... Anne, pass my order. The princess will be named Yuan. We're leaving. Don't disturb us anymore. Oh, Anne, is the king here? Stay in bed, your highness. You just gave birth. You're not supposed to move. Come in, Anne. Tell the queen our little princess's name. Your highness, the emperor named the princess Yuan. Yuan, I thank your majesty for his mercy. One more thing, your highness. Just now, an auspicious omen appeared from heaven. The Sky Watcher told us that the princess is the reincarnation of a goddess. And also... Let's leave now. Your Highness has to rest. He didn't even visit to see his own daughter. How cruel can he be? Bix, you may be the queen in everyone's eyes, but you're the bane of my existence. The moment I obeyed my mother, I betrayed my lover by marrying you. I will give you everything, wealth, honor, even a child. But happiness? No. You're never getting that till you die. I endure your cruelty just for the sake of your mother, Lang. And you're ready. Please have a look, your highness. How did you make me this beautiful? You're already pretty, your highness. And it's important to enhance your beauty when the Empress herself is visiting to see you and your daughter. Your highness, I just... Whoa! You look gorgeous! Look, even Anne doesn't stand a chance against your charms. Anne, what is the noise out there? The Empress has arrived. The concubines are already lined up outside to see her. <gasps> Bix sends her humble greetings to the kind Empress. I apologize for not visiting yesterday. I wanted to, but my health isn't very cooperative at the moment. Where is our little princess? Don't apologize, Mother. Your health is more important. Not more important than my granddaughter. Aunt, bring my daughter. The king is here. <gasps> Mother, how have you been? I'm as fit as a fiddle. Bix, where is your daughter? Let me check on them. My baby! <gasps> Bix, what happened? Is everything okay? Bix! Oh no, the princess is dead. The princess destined for greatness ended up being butchered to her own death. How did she die? Wasn't she supposed to be the greatest queen? Who killed her? Will Ling feel sad for the death of the princess? Will he and Bix mend the relationship over this shared trauma? Find out the answers to these questions in the romance drama, The Shadow Queen, only on Dash 2 now. Download now.